Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. It's Paul on my YouTube tutorial channel. Just wanted to show you a piece of art that I'm currently drawing and painting. This is for the garden, uh, my first attempt at outdoor uh, art. So I'll, I'll be spraying this with some kind of uh, acrylic or outdoor kind of yacht varnish over the top. Uh, just want to show you how I've done this really. Uh, first of all, I drew the zebra out using the grid system. Uh, then I started drawing the whole thing uh, with black uh, ink. So we've been painting this with black ink um, on all the stripes. And then I thought well, I wanted to make it more of an abstract painting. So I'm going to do the background. Um, I can do all the background up here. Um, red and come down here to orange. Um, uh, kind of fade it in um, so hopefully that'll look pretty good uh, up in this area here it's, it's got lots of fur coming off white fur um, so we're going to have a lot more detail lots of fur around here as well but at the moment I've just blocked in the colour it's got a little bit of detail in his eyes got a little bit of white in there just to, to show a bit of reflection um, but this is quite a large canvas it's, it's not taken me too long it's only taken me a couple of evenings so far I've uh, done it about five, well, about four and a half, five hours on it total. Uh, hopefully it'll be finished in ten, ten hours. Um, I've not done any of the white yet. All you can see there is the um, the white canvas and you can still see the grid lines coming in across, across the head here. Um, so what I'll need to do is do a lot more detail in the fur, lots more white. I'm going to paint every one of these uh, with white acrylic. This is acrylic, obviously, I'm using with quite a fine brush um, just to get a little bit more of the fur detail um, so it comes to life, really. Um, but I quite like that. I'll, I'll pull it right back. That's how large it is uh, against the television there. Um, so I'll do another quick video when I've finished and show you the finished um, piece of work. OK, uh, don't forget I've got a uh, art shop on Redbubble as well now uh, so all my art products have been converted onto all sorts of different um, items such as travel mugs and duvet sets and things like that um, check it out um, you simply have to put paulbemboart.redbubble.com and it takes you straight to my my art shop um, it does look like there's only five or six products on there but you have to click into each product and then it gives you an option of about between 50 and 75, 80 products per piece of art. So as soon as I've finished the zebra, I'm gonna put, um, I'm gonna put him onto Redbubble and then uh, this is basically a print on demand service, really high quality printing. Um, journals are really good. Um, mobile phone covers, excellent quality. Um, so go and check that out, I'm quite excited about it. I've already had four or five um, purchases on there in the last 24 hours. Uh, I've only been doing it, putting my work on there for the last um, literally last 40, 40 hours or so um, and that's a global service so it, it sh they ship internationally um, but it's based in the UK so um, obviously in the UK you get your products a little bit quicker I think it's three to five days delivery for products so um, they do all sorts of outdoor products as well or, or um, garden products or conservatory pillows that kind of thing um, so go and check them out uh, hundreds of thousands of um, different artists on there as well so it's just a website to support artists with their products um, so see you soon bye bye